After 150 years, the United States government eventually stopped the program. But the federal government has never, never formally apologized for what happened until today. I formally apologize as President of the United States of America for what we did. I formally apologize. And it's long overdue at the tribal school, at a tribal school in Arizona, a community full of tradition and culture, and joined by survivors and descendants to do just that. Apologize, apologize, apologize. Rewrite the history book correctly. I have a solemn responsibility to be the first president to formally apologize to the Native peoples. Native Americans, Native Hawaiians, Native Alaskans, and Federal Indian boarding schools. It's long, long, long overdue. Quite frankly, there's no excuse that this apology took 50 years to make. The Federal Indian boarding school policy, the pain it has caused, will always be a significant mark of shame, a blot on American history. For too long, this all happened with virtually no public attention, not written about in our history books, not taught in our schools. Let her talk. Let her talk. Oh, no, let, let her go. There's a lot of innocent people being killed. There's a lot of innocent people being killed, and it has to stop. For those 